Okay, so we've just gone on what I played a bit off camera, and that's Vladimir. Ooh, we can make a deck now. I'm actually wanting to make a deck. Because my current deck is doing woeful. I'm actually going to delete it. And what I'm going to build is a deck that just is a board swarm of pain and misery for me. And it's a lease. Straight in the team. And it's also Vlad and Darius. And you're probably wondering, why is it them two? Well, it's quite strong. Bring on you. You're definitely going in for spiderlings. 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 It's a lot of low-cost champions, if you can tell. And I think House Spider, you're coming straight in. Uh, you can come in and... You're a good card. Yeah, you can see I'm building a lot of low... A lot of low cost cards to stack. Because it's how you play this sort of deck. Uh, bring you in, why not? Uh, you can come in. Crowd favorite is a good card. This is a very good card for Spidling decks. You can come in as well. Decimate is a decent damage tool, but I think this is quite good. This is a great card for clearing the board. We won't have any of them, but Darius. Killer unit, that is strong. Get you in. Don't want you in. You're too strong. And we're actually above 40 cards, so let's have a look. I don't want two of you. Might as well go down by one on them. And that's this deck. We'll see how good it is realistically. I hope it's good. It's kind of a mess up of the Death and Spiders deck, you know. But better. So, we'll go with this. Hopefully it works out very nicely for us. And we can actually win a game. Else we're kind of screwed. I'm not gonna lie. I, I realistically think we're gonna be screwed here. As my nose just pumps up even more. And we come up against a Jinx and Zed deck. Yeah. So a standard deck. We have the three heroes. He has the two. We have a very nice starting hand. I'll get rid of that actually. Uh, we have a very, very low cost hand to be honest. It's actually as good for board presence. And we actually do get the Elise early. So I'm going to bring you on because I can. He isn't going to bring on anything. And our turn. And we begin. I pull the strings. That is a fine start. If he wants to summon something, he can. If he doesn't, I'm using Elise to attack here for 5 damage. Hopefully. Anyway, he won't have anything to clear it, realistically. And what's great is, I can do a lot of things to bring in Spiderlings without attacking with Elise, which is great. And at least can level up quite easily. That's okay, you bring on there. Okay. By all means. Skitter out from the darkness. He's probably gonna try and block the damage, but theoretically, he might have the thing that does want damage to at least and kill it. That would make sense for his play. Hold up. But instead, he's gonna kill the spiderling. Okay. 
Makes sense. So young. I guess he doesn't want Elise doing work. Re realistically, it would make sense to do that. Now, what we can do now is... Oh! <laughs> We've got two options here. We can do that or that. I guess we could do that, but... Okay, we do that. Yep, that's fine. Because then a spideling will kill him. We must all make sacrifices. Which is fine for me. I'm happy with that. Okay. I'll gladly trade spidling for five damage. That is actually a worthwhile trade for me. Hands down, we still have five damage on our board for taking out five damage as his for one damage of mine. That is huge. Actually. And we get the attacking turn. Uh go go gadget house spider. Your turn to bring on any characters that you wanna die to an Elise. And when I say die to Elise, I mean next turn I should. In theory, have three spiderlings and an Elise. Okay, he's gonna probably kill off our spiderling here if he's got any sense. Or if he has the two damage to wall thing, he probably use that. Oh, he's still going down on his spells. He's killing one of our units. And he's killing Elise. Uh, I, I wouldn't do that, actually. But he's killing Elise, which is fair enough. And he's killing off that, so... It's our attack turn. Why don't we do that? Now what are you going to do? Five. Bulky damage. Four, five, six damage to you, my friend, is not good. And next turn... You can do that. Oh, that is bad for you. You're not in the best shapes, I'm gonna be honest. If not, I can do that. I've got plays. I actually do have plays. Oh, I can't kill that. I can drain three. In fact, why don't I just do that? Now what are you gonna do? <laughs> yeah, I, I bring out the best in me. And the even better thing is, I'm only going to use one of the spider ones. Because I can use that next turn. And he isn't going to be able to fuck all. So, six mana, one in the back. Make that two mana, one in the back. I mean, realistically, we could have attacked there, but nah. No point. Okay, he's bringing out another one then. I'll bring out that. Reporting in. Now, this is where he has to decide what he's Don't blocking. Worry. I've read all about this. Because I'm just gonna do that. Okay, ready. Free. He's gonna probably block this spiling with that little shit. Uh, you're probably gonna take out my big boy. That's a. My that's still a lot of damage, actually. Yeah, this is 10 damage. Yeah, I'll be honest, you're down to 2 HP. Uh. <laughs> oh! I've got plays here. Oh, Elise. 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 Bring you. Down and round we go. Yep. I sense he's gonna do eight damage to us, yeah. Big whoop. You don't get to attack. Raw. <laughs> Goodbye. I will play my part. Okay. You do that. I'll gladly take the eight damage. I'll bring on the leaves. I know what lurks in the shadows. I don't care. 
My attack then. And spider alert, Elise evolved. Beauty because I have a skin. lot of spiderlings on my board. Oh. Uh, summon a unit. No. No, we're just gonna do that. What can he do against it? In fact, because I'm an arsehole, there you go. You can do nothing to stop the Elise. She's just gonna kill you. <laughs> I, I don't even know why I brought this guy on. In fact, I could have been a troll and actually killed her. By replacing one of the champs, I could have. Oh, why did I do that? That would make sense. Yeah, I think we win. Realistically, he's not gonna kill. If he kills any of these. If this one's alive. Okay, if you're killing it. Night night. Easy peasy. Victory for the boy with an Elise deck. That is huge. And we actually get a nice mission done there. 400 XP for that. And just watch that go up. We claim our vault to level 2. We get ourselves a pack. We're at level 8 on the prologue. Let's continue with our first win with this deck. It actually was very, very useful. And that's going to be an episode, ladies and gentlemen. We also have that as well. Poro bundle. I just saw it. That is the sort of thing I want. Anivia and Heathguard. Okay, nice. Nice rewards. Give me my Poros. This should have a Braum in it, I'd assume. Yep. Oh. My favourite deck is a Poro deck. And if you know me, I love Poros. Yeah, you can understand what I'm going to be building, can't you? With these cards. But yeah, that's going to be it for this episode. I know it's a short one. We've only done one battle in it. But who cares? If you enjoyed it, leave a like down below. Subscribe if you're new out here if you want to. And I will see you guys later. Peace out.